Welcome friends to the 2021 Junior Achievement Business Hall of Fame. It's a pleasure to be with you today as we celebrate the mission of Junior Achievement, the incredible accomplishments of business leaders in Washington and students who are emerging as our future leaders. They say that moving homes is one of the most stressful life events, more stressful apparently than even having a baby. And I had two babies at the same time. My family and I recently moved into a new house and I can attest to just how stressful a process it can be. The move was made all the more stressful, unexpected and strange because it was unplanned. Soon I found it dominating my energy, focus and thought. Sound familiar? No one anticipated, even in the earliest days of our awareness of COVID, that it would be so all-consuming, that it would last this long, interrupt this many plans, and affect such a significant change in our day-to-day -day activity. Back in February of last year, we at JA of Washington were looking forward to a spring spent working with our educators and volunteers on exciting plans all through the remainder of the school year. We were anticipating a summer of fun, welcoming students to our facilities for our JA BizTown summer camp. Fully staffed and prepared for action, we were on track to roll out programs at previously unachieved numbers, and were even laying the foundation of a robust five-year strategic plan. When March came just one month later, everything was derailed. In the uncertainty of stay-at-home directives and empty grocery shelves, watching and waiting to see how schools would be affected, we could only be confident of one thing, that we had to do whatever it took to continue supporting Washington educators, parents, and most importantly, students. With the advent of COVID, we were all suddenly forced in a sense to move into another house, and it was up to us to turn it into a home. As one by one schools closed doors and learning went virtual, we immediately adapted. In a great deal of what we do, we take our cues from you, the Washington State business community leaders, whose diligence, resourcefulness, and perseverance have been an inspiring and uplifting example throughout the pandemic. Leaders who are the very men and women we honor today. We saw you, our peers in business, pivot swiftly to meet changing needs, and we did the same. Within weeks, most of our programming had shifted to free virtual lessons on a variety of platforms, bringing resources and educations to impacted communities. We enlisted friends, you, our corporate partners and donors, to help with the move, and you responded in heartening and supportive ways. Anything that was holding us back, we tossed. We slimmed down our event offerings, moved entirely to remote work, and did away with old processes that were no longer productive. In effect, anything that we could do without, we left behind. We are now a leaner and more agile organization than ever as a result. At the prospect of a new reality, it's easy to look outside and daydream about endless new opportunities. But rather than look outside, we chose to look inside and invest in ourselves. We invested in our virtual programming, virtual events, and most importantly, our relationships. The greatest investment is that which we make every day in our partners, donors, educators, volunteers, students, and staff. At JA, everything we do, we do only with the support of the business community members like you. We're heartened by your unwavering commitment to helping us achieve the JA mission of preparing students for the future. The laureates we honor today have exemplified this commitment not only over the past year, but over their entire careers. The impact of their investment in the leaders of tomorrow is undeniable. It's been a year of hard lessons for all of us. We've learned more directly than we thought possible, not just how unpredictable the future can be, but also how resilient and adaptable our friends, families, and peers can be when under pressure. Like the business community we honor this evening, we at Junior Achievement of Washington are committed to recognizing what we've experienced, honoring what we've lost, and using what we've learned to create a more equitable and just tomorrow for young people. Thank you for your support and for joining us today in the new home we've made in our faith of JA's mission and the potential of our youth. With your continued support, we can help create a new generation fit for the challenges of the future, no matter what they might be. In the future, we're going to continue to adapt, toss and invest, but we will need your help to do it. We will continue to enlist your help to create a stronger future for the students of Washington. Let's achieve together.